Hey guys, and welcome to How to Feed the Beast. Um, today we're going to be looking at steam boilers, um, specifically the low pressure steam boiler. The first thing that you're going to need is a rolling machine. Um, this does require power, um, and you uh, put four iron in, and you will get four iron plates. What you can do with those iron plates is uh, put two in a crafting grid like this and make a low pressure steam uh, boiler tank. What you will need um, uh, with the tank is a firebox. Um, there are solid and liquid fueled fireboxes, and if we look, the solid fuel takes bricks uh, add along with the fire charge. The liquid is um, steel plates and um, iron bars. Now the steel plates you can make the same as the iron, you would just have to have steel and I will cover that in a, a later episode. Okay, so what you can do to put these together and in this case I'm just going to put down the solid fuel is you put down your boiler, uh, your fuel box and then you put down your tank right? in the configuration that you want. And you can see here it creates a multi-block, and it'll tell you how long um, it it can use to uh, to burn this the different fuels. Now, obviously, the solid fuel um, requires solid fuel like coal coke, coal coke, uh, peat, um, coal, charcoal, things like that. The liquids, which if we come over here, require things like fuel ethanol or creosote. Uh, fuel obviously is going to give you the best uh, with the liquids. Now you can make a small boiler like this and the power output that you're going to get is about two Minecraft joules. Um, and that's even with an industrial steam engine. The next size boiler is a 2x2 two two base and a 2x2x2 two by two by two tank. Um, you can output about 16 Minecraft jewels. The next one is uh, the same size base, 2x2, two two, but the tank is 2x2x3. Two by two by and with this size tank, um, or with this size boiler, you can output about 24 Minecraft jewels. Uh, the next size up is a 3x3 three three base, and it's 3x3x2 three by three by uh, for the tank. This one does about 36.3 Minecraft joules, and it's because each one is running about 7.1 to 7.3. Um, the next one is the same size base, it's just one more higher, so it's 3 by 3 by 3. Um, and this one does uh, 54.25 Minecraft joules, and that's because each one runs about 7.7, 7.8. So I, I figure 7.75. The biggest of the steam boilers is a 3x3 three three base and 3x3x4 three three uh, for the tank. And you can output um, 72.5 Minecraft joules per tick. Um, and that's that's because you're, you have, can have 10 engines running around 72 um, or 7.25. Okay, now we'll go ahead and look at the EU production that a steam boiler can put out. Um, with the one steam boiler tank, it puts out uh, about 6 EU per tick. Not very impressive. Um, if you were only going to make the smallest version, I wouldn't even bother. Uh, you're going to use up fuel and it it not really matter. The next size up it will create uh, about 50 EU per tick. And that's because um, the steam turbine can now put... 200 EU per tick, and this is only running at about 25, uh, 25%. The next uh, size, the three, uh, the two by two by three, for the the steam boiler, um, will produce 76 EU per tick, and that's because this runs at about about 38%. Uh, next ends up the three by three uh, by two will produce 112. The 3x3x3 three by three by three is 170 
And then finally, the 3x3x4 three by three by is a really, really big one. You actually need two turbines to get all of the use out of it. It'll create 232 EU. Um, they will regulate themselves uh, a little bit. This one's running at about 33, 34. This one's running at about 80. Um, one thing to note um, with the heat, the only thing that this affects is how much fuel you actually use. If we look here, we get um, 10,901 ticks, and this one's 13,418. Um, the, the temperature does not affect your steam output. It only affects your fuel usage. Um, with that, uh, I think we'll go ahead and end it here. One thing to note is, um, is I have heard, I have not tested, however, I have heard that if you output all of your um, steam as EU and then convert it to MJ through uh, electrical, electrical engines, um, you actually get more MJ output. Um, again, I have not tested that. That's just something that I have heard. And I hope that clears up the low pressure steam boilers. Uh, I will put out a high pressure one. The main difference is um, is the materials used. It needs steam or, or steel, and um, and also uh, the amount of fuel usage. Uh, it does pr high pressure do produce um, about twice as much steam. And with that, I will see you guys later. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, everyone counts and. Uh, Feel free to leave any comments on any of the videos. I do try to read them all and, um, and if I can respond. And with that, I will see you guys later.